the Shipwrecked Sailor, an Egyptian tale with hieroglyphs, written and illustrated by Tamara Bauer. The early Egyptians lived along the Nile River in northern Africa more than 5,000 years ago. One way that we know about these early people is through their writing. Unlike most people today, the ancient Egyptians used picture symbols to record their thoughts. Over time, Archaeologists have been able to translate many of the ancient stories of the Egyptians. Here is an excerpt from one of them. This ancient story was written in picture writing about 4,000 years ago. The sentence highlighted below is shown on the next page as it would have been written using picture symbols. I was sailing the Red Sea on a great ship, 120 cubits long, and 40 cubits wide, bound for the gold mines of Nubia. There were 120 of the best and bravest sailors of Egypt. There wasn't a fool among them. Their hearts were fiercer than lions. The arm of each one was stronger than the next, and the heart of each one was braver. They laughed at the thought of a storm. But suddenly, a great wind arose and a mighty wave dashed against our ship, breaking the mast. I grabbed hold of a piece of wood, and none too soon. The ship sank, and of those in it, I was the only one to survive. I floated until the surf cast me on an island shore. I crawled beneath some trees and fell asleep. When I awoke, I found myself in paradise. All around me, were good things to eat, ripe figs, grapes, vegetables, grain, and an abundance of fish and wildfowl. I ate until I was full. The sailor's paradise does not last long. Soon he comes face to face with a giant serpent. Fortunately, they become friends. When it is time for the sailor to return home, the serpent presents him with gifts for the pharaoh. 